Well, here is a Mr. Coo the Keurig, Mr. Coffee Maker here, and I let vinegar sit in there mid-brew, like put it the vinegar in there, and it wasn't brewing right. Now it's brewing, but I let it sit in my Keurig for maybe a month, and then I had problems. Um, getting it to brew so I took it apart and I was looking at it and then I got mad and shook it up and then I tried to brew it and it brewed and I kept flushing it out with water so I don't, I don't really recommend doing that but there was something in there clogging it up but now it's brewing actually pretty decent coffee but the problem here also what I wanted to talk about is these eco brewers and you know these are the filters, and this is the K-Cup compatible. I want to let everybody know that they're not compatible with this thing. They're just not. You get the ones from the dollar store or the Dollar Tree like this, and they won't even shut. Like, none of these will shut. So I've tried over them. I don't want to waste anyone's time, but these don't work in Mr. Coffee Keurigs but if you need to descale it you just put some vinegar in it and you keep running it but then you let it run I would suggest maybe a couple of days the vinegar doesn't actually do anything to the rubber or anything like some of those descaler people say but don't waste your money on any of these I'll be taking this back to the store and these back to the store it doesn't help with brewing and it doesn't fit in here I don't know if it helps on the other ones my aunt uses this on a legitimate Keurig but they work fine on hers but guess what it doesn't work on mine but anyways just want to let you know if yours is not going completely through if it's not brewing then try shaking it up obviously unplug it Take the water off of it, drain it out, and shake the crap out of it. And you could probably get it to brew. And you know, and then they have the paper clip thing where you stick the paper clip up in there. Up in the little hole. So you stick it in there. But I took it apart to see if it had mold in it and stuff. And this is what it looks like on the inside. Here. And the pump's back behind there. And this is where all the scaling really actually happens, is that's the heating element. There's just a coil inside of that thing. And, uh, but you want to descale it, because once <laughs> that fills up, you're not going to get anything through there. I hope this helps everybody not waste money, because I don't actually even know if they sell these Mr. Coffee Keurigs anymore. But... Do not waste your money. They will not work on Mr. Coffee Keurigs. Anyways, now I actually have a decent brew because before it was completely watery. But I let the vinegar sit in the coil for like a month. And now I have, I have good coffee again. Yay, look at that deep, deep pretty color instead of drinking water that looks like tea. Anyways, I hope that helps. Peace out. Subscribe, like.